Hi, welcome to Inkscape for Teachers. I'm Jeff Phillips and in this tutorial I'll be showing you how I used a rounded corners extension to Inkscape to change a sharp cornered object into this rounded one here. It's useful when you're designing um, smooth little icons or other diagrams or figures in Inkscape. Now first of all I'll show you where we get this from. If you go to your browser and Google Inkscape extensions. If I do that the uh, top one will come up here, inkscape.org, uh, etc. Click on that. And the first page of extensions will load. But if I scroll down a bit here, you can see there are a number of extensions. But I think it's around about the third page. You can try them all if uh, things change by the time this you see this video. And you can see here's a rounded corners extension. If I click on that, up comes some information about the extension. But you can click on the diagram here and that will download rounded corners etc. .zip and you need to extract that, uh, the files in that zip archive to a particular file in Inkscape. For my computer it was this uh, directory here but there will be somewhere on your computer in Inkscape under programs I would assume Inkscape uh, etc. extensions folder. Extract the zip archive files into that folder and then restart Inkscape. Once you do that you'll have that uh, extension available and I'll show you where in a, in a moment. If I just um, control D duplicate that object, I'll give this one a different fill colour and you may have to if you've used a rectangle or other shapes go path, object to path I don't have to here, it already is a path but just be aware that that's an option. If uh, the extension fails then extensions modify path and you should see rounded corners under here. If I do that you get an option to preview and change the units of the, uh, the rounding. Just click the live preview you can see if I increase the uh, amount there the corners are even more rounded. Once you're happy apply and close and there's your new shape. If you want the original make sure you duplicate it before you transform it. But that's a handy extension for some aspects of uh, Inkscape. As always, thanks for watching.